It was a mortal heart that saved two worlds from ruin and cast down the prime evil forever. champion, the Nephilim, rose to confront the darkness that we, in our pride, would not face. place among you once again but this time as a mortal since justice has been met this day I will now stand as wisdom on behalf of those who risked all to save us Forevermore, we shall stand together, angels and men, in the light of this glorious new dawn. essence lingers in the black soul stone. I cannot destroy the stone, nor allow its evil to remain within the heavens. And so it must be hidden, even from the angels. I pray that it will be enough. Service here is finished, and you should all run. Now fail.
Killing began in West March. Of that, I am sure. The angels have started a massacre, slaying all they find. I must see it with my own eyes and learn why they have come. There are many questions, and I have little time to act. Soul stone. You must come with me. Too many have died. I will intervene. But you and Tyriel need to form a plan. We must find Malkin. Tyriel should meet me in Westmarch. Go. It will be done. I swear it. No, not here. the sound of his screams until his flesh dissolved. The gates. His gates are bound. At least there are other ones. This reaper wields a dangerous sword. Its shield, with its rows of razor-sharp spikes, poses the greater threat. With a single thrust, it can open a man from waist to throat. That shield was not made for protection. It was made to cripple, maim, and kill. Malfield's fallen angels have brought death to Westmarch, raising an army of reapers from the city's slain defenders. Once, these men and women were our protectors. Now, they are our executioners, scouring the city for every living soul and putting them to the sword. It's the end of the world. So many have been killed and the Reapers are everywhere. Are there other survivors? General Torian was defending a group of refugees at the old Zakarun Cathedral, but they're likely all dead by now. We'll see.
shadow touched me, and darkness spread across my vision until all I could see was blackness. It gave way to a pale light that sapped my strength. It seems easy. But instead, I drew upon the last of my will and fought back. Color flooded back into my sight. The shadow was right before me, and I drove my spear through. The Revenant Shield Guards were once the personal guard of King Justinian IV. Appointed to the position for bravery and skill at arms, they accompanied the king at all times, resplendent in their ornate armor, wrought by the finest craft in the West. But most spectacular were their shields, which they unerringly employed in the protection of their king. Make a fine corpse. Defend the church! The penalty file we Ah, we found you. Never seen an attack like this. Why has Malthael unleashed his forces on West March? Because he feeds on death. Every time his Reapers kill, he grows stronger. And with the prime evil gone, Malthael believes this is the perfect time to end the eternal conflict. Humanity has nothing to do with that war. I agree. Church! All the refugees are inside! Follow me! Akrat's Bane! This is worse than I feared! What is it? A death ring! Stop her! Never know. Your soul will be mine. Any other archer would have fled My as bag is full. We fooled. must do everything in our power to slow the Nephilim down, so that the collection of souls is not interrupted. It is the key to Malthiel's victory. <laughs> We must confront Malthael. Where is he? I know only that he is not in Westmarch. He could have taken the Black Soul Stone anywhere in creation. There are no other clues? There may be. A sliver broke off when Malthael took the Soul Stone. Perhaps by studying that sliver, I can learn his plans. Then you must remain here. I will do what I can for Westmarch. They thought they would be safe in here, but they were trapped.
What was that death maiden doing? She was creating an orb that turns the living into Malthale's death creatures. A single orb can transform hundreds of innocent people every hour, and my men report two more of them out in the city. So, Crucibles, with two of them, Malthale has an endless supply of soldiers. This magic was not meant to be used, so... I will not stand for it. Radrum have returned. Tyriel rebuilt the Order to help him take the Soul Stone from Heaven, and to protect mankind. After all, you can't be everywhere at once, no matter how powerful you are. I have read spells about crucibles that could enslave the dead. Now angels are using them? Sadly, yes. And the Death Maidens as well. Their story is as tragic as Malthian's. Once the vanguard of his wisdom angels, they followed him down the path to darkness. Malthale, my brother. He was wisdom. Leader of our council. First among angels. And now, he has become this. How? After the destruction of the World Stone, Malthael's mood darkened, and he left the heavens frequently. Then he disappeared completely. He must have developed a connection, no, an obsession with human souls. He was never meant to explore the domain of death. What would Rathma say if he were here? Any progress? The sliver is still connected to the Soul Stone. As the stone changes, the sliver will change too. Therefore, I can observe what Malfail is doing to the stone, and if we're lucky, even discover his plan. We stay to fight, Robert and me. But it fell. And when they started to tear into him, I panicked. I ran. Many of the survivors here have suffered the same. You should speak to them. At long last, a hero comes to save us! That won't bring my wife back, though. Will it? My library isn't far from here. I was closing everything up for the day when I heard the fighting in the streets. I barred the doors and then squeezed through the back window to escape. But I'll have to come up with something more exciting when I write my official account, won't I? You've heard the legend of the Tomb of Rackus, haven't you? Its location has never been found. Most scholars think it's underneath Westmarch, but I suspect it's somewhere outside the city. Rackus was a clever man, after all. Westmarch originally grew from the efforts of the great General Rakis to spread his religion beyond the realms of the East. Seized by the superstitions of the Zakarum faith, he drove his paladins relentlessly across the barbaric western lands, subduing the uncivilized tribes he found there. Ultimately, he became king of them all. Insist.
you hear something? Is something on your mind? You think Cardium is under attack as well? It must be. At least they have the Iron Wolves. Lord of Lies could not break them. The Angel of Death will not either. responsible for this. It's the poor. They've summoned these monstrosities to take Westmarch for themselves. I can't believe we're still alive. And it's all thanks to you. I thought we would die in that foul-smelling place. You are ill at ease, Cormac. For too long have I lived with the knowledge that my order tortures its initiates and twists their minds. I need to know how high this evil reaches. If my whole order is corrupt, what does it mean to be a Templar? What am I? You are one of many who believed in serving a righteous cause. But it wasn't, was it? The guilty will answer for their transgressions. I swear it. The world's under attack and people are dying everywhere. It must be time for us to go on another adventure, right? Did you grab the jewelry at least? Harold, those monsters were about to kill us. Well, I would rather be dead than poor. You ask who's to blame? For this doom, all West. Did you know there were once two moons? Lyria is the one that is no more. <laughs> I think it's time I told you the whole story of Zai and his master, the god of desire, Durgis. I thought it was a secret. Durgis' jewel has appeared again, and the time for secrets is over. Then I will finally know the truth. <laughs> Uh, have you been eating enough? I I've noticed this about you. When things get difficult, you get very focused. Uh, maybe I'll cook for you. So, if it's all the same, we'd probably both be happier if I didn't. What the hell is going on out there? Someone came for me, after all this time. The blacksmith heard you down here. Bloody miracle! Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. I owe you both. Follow me. Remember that noise I heard? It was that lad you rescued. I'm Bryson. I came here to see your friend. <laughs> and now he won't go away. You don't feel responsible for him? No, I'm responsible for myself. Though I have decided to repay Hadric by helping him. And I told you to stay away from my forge.
I grew up over by the docks. Not the good part of town, but it's what my parents could afford. They died when the plague swept through a few years ago, within hours of each other, like they had to stay together. I used to hate them for leaving me, but now it's a relief they didn't have to see all this happen. the angels do this to us? is you. The attacks are getting worse. They'll reach the survivors soon. Days, these people can't last much longer. Head to the survivors' army. Disappears. The Angiris Council appointed his most loyal servant, Urze, to find him and bring him back to the High Heavens. Urze, accompanied by the set of witnesses who were Malthiel's closest followers, set out to find their absent master. They never returned. of the exorcists of Westmarch, those spiritual warriors specialized in removing demonic possession. By custom, they arrive in darkness, clad in cloaks as black as the night that conjured them. They work in secret, extracting the demon. This is all Justinian's fault! Some king he is! City by now, it's time for the people to rise up! You should leave these petty matters behind. But this is our chance to get out from under the king's yoke! <laughs> I am 
encountered the most troublesome bats in the caves outside Westmarch. My companions and I had sheltered there with the intent of organizing my many records when the miserable creatures appeared and tore several of the skulls to pieces. Truly, the world shall be a poorer place for this lost wisdom. Beckons. Thanks for helping, but this isn't over. The King has failed us all. If you don't believe me, read this. His private journal. How did you come by this? Well, let's just say it's from someone who cares about us common folk. I'm so weary. Why did you have to die, brother? I was never meant to be king. The nobles threaten revolt to bend me to their will. They will abandon me if I don't keep the peasants in their place. Oh, my position is hopeless. Is there anything about the past you would like to know? Were there any spells that would be of use to us now? None that you would care for. Most of them are forgotten for good reason. Many would drive those who use them mad. Or worse.
death nears. Some of my men are pinned down in the courtyard, fighting revenants. Please help me rescue them. Do you know why this is happening? It's madness! It's a battle. Lead your men to the survivor's enclave at the cathedral. March killed both humans and beasts alike. The panicked survivors then threw the corpses of both into the plague cutter. Now the Reaper's presence has revived many of those interred there, with the bones of beasts rising again as skeletal forms driven The phantasms are unlike any spirits I have seen on Sanctuary. They bear a resemblance to lesser demons. But the souls of demons are always reborn in the hells. I suspect the phantasms may be the remnants of some early Nephilim, those born more demon than angel.
promontory of boats, commonly called the plague tunnels, were originally used to bury West March's indigent. However, when the Great Pestilence struck, the city decided the tunnels would serve just as well for plague victims, lest West March become overwhelmed I am by the ever increasing piles of the dead. Together, it is not surprising that many plagues afflicted Westmarch. I am returning to town. <laughs> 